Aaron Hernandez, once a rising star in the NFL, had a life marked by both triumph and tragedy. Born in Bristol, Connecticut on November 6, 1989, Hernandez's passion for football was evident from a young age. Growing up in a supportive family environment, he quickly rose through the ranks, showcasing immense talent on the football field. This talent earned him a scholarship to the University of Florida, where he excelled as a standout tight end for the Gators. In 2010, Hernandez declared for the NFL draft and was selected by the New England Patriots in the fourth round. His career with the Patriots started off promisingly, with Hernandez becoming a key player in their offense and helping the team reach the Super Bowl in 2012. However, his success on the field was soon overshadowed by off-field troubles. In June 2013, Hernandez was arrested and charged with the murder of Odin Lloyd, a semi-professional football player and acquaintance of Hernandez. This shocking revelation sent shockwaves through the sports world and marked the beginning of a tumultuous legal battle. As more details about Hernandez's troubled past emerged, including alleged involvement in other violent incidents, his fall from grace seemed inevitable. In April 2015, Hernandez was found guilty of first-degree murder in the Lloyd case and sentenced to life in prison without the possibility of parole. Tragically, his story took a dark turn in April 2017, when he was found dead in his prison cell. The official cause of death ruled as suicide by hanging. His death left many questions unanswered and sparked debates about the mental health challenges faced by professional athletes. The cautionary tale of Aaron Hernandez serves as a stark reminder of the complexities of fame, success, and the consequences of choices made both on and off the field. His life, marked by both triumph and tragedy, serves as a sobering reminder of the fragility of human existence and the high price of fame. You all gotta remember at the end of the day, it's your world, everyone else just living in it. So you have to make the right decisions to get to the next phase that is awaiting you. I pray for you all. Please like and sub. I need all the help I can get to help the lil homies that need guidance. God bless Tantrum Nose.